I think the, the Iraqi Kurds, President Rezani's KDP, I think you're the closest now you've ever been to independence. But I don't think you'll, you'll have independence until you put the political parties aside. You have to put the KDP aside, the PUK aside, Goran aside, the Islamic parties aside, and unite as Kurds. Not, you don't unite as political parties. And once you do this, then I think I think you will get the uh, you will get the agreement of the other nations that you can come together. But as long as you have the differences that you have right now in the political, in the, in the major political parties, certainly yeah. the three political parties, there'll be no independence. The the, the greatest. The greatest detriment right now to Kurdish independence is the Kurds themselves. And I think the, the advice I say is to, to put your political differences aside. You've done that many times before. You started, you did it in 1991 and banded together. Put your political differences aside, band together, uh, have strong, strong uh, talks with the Americans and the Brits, and then you have to work out what, the, what problems it would be causing for the Turks and the Iranians. But I think independence is, is, can happen now. I think it's doable now. But it'll never happen until you put the political differences between the, the parties aside. And think about Kurdistan first and not the political party first. And I know President Razan has tried. He's tried several times. I've talked to him about it. And I think we just have to keep trying. I think he and... He and uh, he and, and Noshawan of Iran and, and the elements of the UK, maybe it's maybe Hero, uh, uh, Baram Salah, Kasrat, others, I think they all need to get together and they need to agree that what's important right now is a unified Kurdistan. And right now you have the best chance you've ever had to be independent. But once you get independence, then you have to be able to support the nation and do what the nation needs. And that's why you need to put the political differences aside and, and come together, create a nation, and go from there. Well, I think Iran has incredible uh, influence in the region, and a lot of, the, a lot of that is because we let them. We, we allow them to do that. We, the United States, and I don't think we should allow them. I, mean, I wish that we would step in right now and say that what our policy is is, uh, is to protect and ensure the standing of Iraqi Kurdistan and protect Iraqi Kurdistan and, uh, and make it a protector of the United States. I, I think that would be one of the, strategically one of the best things we could do. It depends on the Kurds. It's de it, depends on, it depends on whether the Kurds can get along with each other. The greatest enemy the Kurds have right now is, is among themselves. Of the United States? Yes. Support Kurdistan. Thank you.